Hello everyone and welcome back to another recording session for Ruined King. So, apparently, uh, when I came back to this today, yesterday I recorded like 30 minutes because I got interrupted. Um, but apparently I, I didn't save it right or something or other because we were back at the drowned port, but I just walked back over here. I found a chest with some potions in it. And a, um, thingy thing, a shrine or whatever to give you a buff, a firebrand. I just think it increases your attack power if you land in it, which is pretty good. Um, but we're back at the library. We will be going into the Coastal Academy. That's what it's called, not the library. There is this dude here. We're gonna bap him. Firebrand. What, what does it do? What do? Can I not see what do? Grants Firebrand to a champion in the region. X attack will deal 13 magic damage per hit. No. Oh. That's not that great. It's okay. It's not that great, though. My turn. We'll kill the exploding wisp first. Oh, he did the thing. He did the thing. The thing that makes him do lots more damage. I don't like that. I don't like that for me. Uh, let's do this. And then we shall do this. And then... Uh, so we'll do that. Get off his damage shield so he doesn't do as much damage to me. Which is always good. Less damage to me is, uh, always good. Oh, this, yeah, we'll do that because we are going to do a plunder. And we will do a quick. No, none of this is going to be able to get off before we... Okay, we'll just do a normal attack then. Yay! Alright. Once again, count how many times I say alright in this series. I'll give you I'll give you a dollar. Maybe. Um, reinforced fishing rod. So, the plan is... We're gonna go find these people, the people that are here in the academy, and then we're gonna head back to um, uh, the the town because we have a whole bunch of side quests over back in the town. We're gonna try to go. Actually, we'll probably go until we get Ari, which shouldn't be too terribly long. Probably most of this session we'll be trying to get there, but then we'll go back and we'll do some side quests so we're not super duper far ahead of it. Uh, you can use this gate. So, once again, once you travel through the gate, you're by yourself with Pike. You don't have the rest of your team. Now, there's three gates here. I think the last one is the one we need to go into. Or we might need to go into all of them. I don't particularly remember this bit. A makeshift bed constructed in a ruined bookshelf. Um, get ten gold there. What is this? Realms of Spirits, Volume One: Discovery of the Realm. Uh, click into book. Read into book. It is four days until the king tide, and my nightly observations have been confounded by the lightning storms and tor torrential rain that have beset us. It has been hot and muggy and not even the dawn brings fresh breaths of air from the ocean. Somewhere above us beyond the smoldering thick blanket, pinprickles of celestial geometry are crying out to be seen, to be read, to be heard. 
But instead, I awake each afternoon sticky and exhausted. My notes featuring nothing but a single scored line through the page and a sorry tale. How can we know the future if we cannot see the present? Wise words from that dude. I feel like the m volume is up again. No? We're gonna turn it down just a little bit more because I am, it's a little loud for me. I don't know what changed. I just I think I might have just turned up my headset, but I hope you guys could still hear it. I won't find that out until I start chopping up this. I should, uh, where's my phone? Hang on, one second everybody. Where did I put my phone? I don't know where I put my phone. I don't remember. I don't know where I put my phone. Uh, it is 11.46. We will go until we feel like stopping. And hopefully that will uh, be okay. Alright. Uh, more book. Village is worse than the docks. No trouble so far, but everything's suspended. Haven't found any bodies, but the folk here clearly aren't among us any longer. Look like they're made of fog. Try talking to a few. Few even start talk back, but it's like they're having an entirely different conversation. Fed our supplies, though. Enough staves and oil to patch us up and see us shoved off this awful place. Only trick is, the building keeps crashing to the ground and reforming. Pench has started to time it. Get about a minute and a half between shatterings, given how much we need, means we'll be here at least a few days. That's a completely different book. Uh, I need a ring for this. That is probably in the last one. Huh, Halo. Halo gets it. Halo's currently laying at my door. Wondering why I'm talking to myself. Just, you know, typical dog tings. Oh, she's leaving because I talked about her. It's okay. What is this? Aftermath. God, it's been a day since the explosion, I suppose? Whatever horror struck the capital and turned the seas to ink. We finally made landfall on the blessed shore. What else are we supposed to do? We were down to our last ration and had nowhere else to go. Of course we tried to make anchor. It wasn't Golf's fault we crashed. The fog on the shore was dark. The strange mist everywhere, though the dock was undamaged, just as we saw it the last time we were here. We pulled alongside it, but a neck, but the next moment a broken ship rose out of the water right in front of us, broken planks melding back together as if time walked backward. I'll claim responsibility for the call, but not the catastrophe. What mortal could have dreamed this up? Phantom workers still haul goods towards ships that shattered sink and reform. We need supplies. We'll be going... We're going to have to go inland. Uh, there is a door here. I cannot open the door. The motionless body of a man is draped across the bed, twitching every so often as if jolted by magical energy. There is a ring on his bloated left hand that seems... To absorb magic from the air around it. It might fit the altar in the previous room. Cut off the ring finger. You dare disturb my slumber? Now we have to fight all by our lonesome. Ap. Death by a thousand cuts, huh? We will be fine. Back to the list. Back to the list. Gus is leaving me now. Yay, Captain Fortune leveled up. Woo! Arrogant, even in death. Alright, let's look at her runes. Um. Right. 
Let's... Well, like, the evade thing is just, like, it doesn't happen very often. I guess this one. We'll get 20 overcharge if we evade an attack that'll let us do more lane attacks rather than doing main attacks. Uh, the altar hums to life. An image class is out of raw... Numa, numbra of... Penumbra? Penumbra? I don't know what that word is. I feel like I should, but I don't. Of magic that surrounds it. It looks like a map of the surrounding rooms. On the, on the map, there are two glowing stones. One in the hallway and one in the adjoining dormitories. Pressing these stones will break the magical barriers they power. What is the hallway? Hallway is the one... Yeah. Always the one that we needed. I guess... I guess that's it. We'll go back. Go back to our, uh... Team. Team in the loosest sense of the word. Alright, this guy hurts. They are really, really tough. You want a shot at me? Not only do they have a bazillion health, they have Deathly Speed, which increases haste by 10% and an additional 20% per marked champion. Uh, they deal moderate magical damage in quotation marks to each champion only usable after an ally dies and then their guillotine does heavy damage there's additional damage to champions up to 50 percent hp they hurt like what they they hurt a lot and and i and i hate fighting them because even like even if you're like a bunch of levels ahead of them they will generally still kick your ass for how much they just it's just a lot of damage it's just a lot of damage i want this guy dead i warned you and then we are going to put pike up to mark him And we have Executioner. So let's do a heavy one of these. Out of steam. Ow. And get... Well, we'll just have Pike go sooner. So he's low. Um... He's gonna get an attack regardless. Let's let's push Alawi before him so that Alawi can taunt and then defend. And then we will do another plunder in the speed lane. We'll just shoot him. And then we'll have Alawi. Oh, never mind. We got him. I was gonna have Alawi heal herself, but. That's okay. Yeah, so that wasn't too terribly bad. But I'm sure you can see the issue. And how much damage those guys do. Because, um, without them... Like, if there's more than one of them... It's just awful. Like, truly abhorrent. Now it's two of these guys, okay. Bones teach better lessons. Um Can someone get me some help. Yikes. No, you're gonna you're gonna hit Alawi. Alawi can take it. Huh. Uh 
Um, let's do. Let's do a double up. Let's heal you. Mark somebody. And then do this. I don't know how she has so many shots in that, but it's fine. Uh, we can probably do this. Make sure he's low enough that Pike could probably kill him. Uh, we'll taunt again. Normal attack, and we'll do this, and we'll do this, and we'll allow we There we go. That's what you get from my crew. Not bad, not bad. Pretty simple. Two things that need to die immediately. Over here is the library. Now that I'm thinking about it. I think one of the people that we need to find is in here. Uh, the mist. The black mist is filled. This room has trapped these books in an, in an old middle ground between decay and preservation. Their titles, A Brief History of Runes, Notes on Arcanocracy, are meaningless now. Hello. Partial something xenoglossy partial. Oh, there it is. Uh, a tall, lanky mistwalker hunches over an open book. Are you Elora? Yes, I am she. How do you know my name? Ah, so you come from the town then. I see. Were you looking for something in particular? Uh, do you have any supplies? Why, yes, I actually do. Well, you have potions. I'll take, like, two of these things. Um, well, my phone's ringing. Where is it? I'll be right back. Alright, back to the old grind, I suppose. This is my alarm to take my happy pills. Alright, do I need something? You should head back. You are probably white. W white? You're probably white. Uh, wouldn't want to keep the others waiting. Stay safe on your travels. You too. Um, unlike the rest of the store, this library, devoted entirely to the topic of magical wards, illusionary barriers, and protections from curses, has been completely ransacked. This 
scrap of parchment on the table reads, Remember, A between B's, C comes third, nature before all. Uh, the books on the shelf labeled librarian's favorites are arranged neatly and alphabetically in contrast to the rest of the academy. Perhaps they deserve a second look. Check the books. Uh, while the rest of the majority of the shelf is unremarkable, upon closer inspection you discover that four books are attached to some mechanism to the wall. When these books are pulled from the shelf, the door makes a clicking sound. If the door... if the books are pulled in the correct order, maybe something would happen. When we put nature before all... Um... A between B's. So we put this one, and then this one, and then this one. As soon as the final book snaps into place, the door whirs to life, shaking off centuries of dust. You've succeeded in opening the door. Yay! Woo! Various tickets used for spells and scientific study are laid out collecting dust. I already read that. What is this one? Now uh, these books on the shelf are anonymous with dust close. Inspection reveals only one book title. Varieties of Xenoglossy amongst the Vestaya. Whatever that means. Uh, Ari would be interested in that one. Uh, mm, suspicious. Uh, four views of the Vault of the Blackbirds. Northwind brushes the giant's face. He watches distant blackbirds. Taro Irides, number three, from the four views of the vault of the blackbird. A shadow falls from the southwest. The dark vault smothers each flapping wing. A shadow falls from the southwest. I don't... Oh, that... Alright, okay. No, I know what that is. More stuff. Uh, is this better than what I have? No. Is this better than what I have? Yes. Slightly. Moving swiftly forward. Count how many times I say that <laughs> in these in these episodes. Moving swiftly forward and all right and okay and um That'd be fun. Maybe I'll make a compilation of all the times I say alright, and just have it like rapid fire. That'd be pretty funny. Well, it would only really be funny to people who have watched the series. Or, like, watching me. Because I'm sure I'll probably say that in all of my series. Which, I don't know what I'm going to do next, in terms of the series. I have a lot of games I want to play, um, and that in and of itself is great, but I've also kind of relegated all of the games that I have downloaded to potential series, so nothing is for me anymore. So I've been actually getting a couple of games on my laptop for just me, which would also make fun series, but I just want it to be for me. And I could talk about it, but I'm not going to, like, actually record them because I want my channel to be mostly, if not all, like, Xbox gaming content because I never really see that. And I don't know if there's really a space for it on YouTube, but I'm going to attempt to fill that space regardless. And try to, um get a channel going. Granted, I think actually, I should say Happy New Year's because this will probably come out around that time, if not before. Um, maybe after. No, this should be, this should be either on New Year's Day or the second. Uh, if I remember my scheduling correctly. Uh, I'm recording this on the, like, 19th of December. Is it today the 19th? Today's the 19th of December. Um, so... I... I am a couple of weeks ahead of schedule. 
but I kind of want to finish this game before the end of December. So I'll have all the videos ready to go so I can start doing other things. I guess I'll just keep doing this. I'd like- I'm just gonna do this again to get Alawi healed back up, because I think there's a big boy down at the bottom of this thing. And I don't really want to be low health to fight the big boy. I also am probably going to use a mana potion on her because she's used a bunch of mana for taunting. I don't really need- I need like the smallest mana potion I have. Minor mana potion, this one, 20. Yeah, two of those and one for Pike. Right, that he only needed 15, but still. Alright, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Alright, I will do a cut. I'll do the these next couple of fights without talking so I can just speed through them. <laughs> oh, I hate those guys! Oh, I hate those guys. They hurt. Instruction desk covered with books of lectures. Oh, more, a little less defense for haste. Yeah, sure, why not? Noble Choker, Magic Defense, Bonus Damage, and Stamina. What do you have? Let's do this for a Lowie. Oh, let's, um... Yeah. 
Yeah, that's good enough, I guess. I'll throw another mana potion on a Lowie. I don't usually use potions all that much, but... I don't know, this particular playthrough seems to be more difficult than I would have thought. The spirits here are restless. What do you know of spirits? In Ionia, the spirits are calm. The world flows around them. Rocks and the stream. Perhaps I would like to go there 